How to clean throttle body in Toyota Camry car. And now we are talking Toyota Camrys what are what have this VVTI engine like this 2.4 liter or then this six cylinder gasoline engine. And throttle body is over in there and next I will show you that how to clean this throttle body. Okay, and then when I start this cleaning, there is really idea that I have to remove this all black things in that area. Now we can see that how much there is this black dirt is. And for that cleaning, now we need gasoline or then some specific like Volvo lines carburetor cleaner. This is like spray what I install in here and that way this only purpose is to remove these black oily things and then I need of course I need these clean cotton clothes. These cotton clothes are best even better than paper because we can take these all black things in inside this cotton cloth. And now I need to clean. As we can see, it is full of dirties. Let's go to look closer. There is so much this black oil that it even stops and ends this throttle valve movement because there is so much. And that's when I clean these all always. Then I have better fuel economy and then a little bit cleaner and also my throttle body works better. Idle speed is better and also this uh, response for gas pedal. And now I need to take all of these dirties away and soon we can see that how clean this is when I use this my cotton cloth and I remove all of these dirties. And then when I am cleaning this throttle body valve I can press this side and open that totally. And then I can same time clean this area, this side, that side area and also this border and this central part in that way. And in this area in here, when I keep my fingers in here, in that way, then I can also clean this, this middle area better. And I can move, I can move this throttle valve also. And then, of course, this outer area, it must be also clean. And then I can rotate that another side. And this is like throttle body cleaning. And this is really useful because then we have better this throttle body response. And in that area I can also clean this central part then and then I have last last trick what we can use and if we have very difficult areas in here and this my last trick is and then we need also this cotton but Johnson and Johnson is very high quality brand. I like that brand. And then I take these cotton pads and when we use these then I can even better clean these small areas in here. And let's go to look closer how I clean those. Now we have nice view in there 
And then when I te take this cotton pad, I can take these very sensitive areas away. And this is good that when this white point becomes dirty, then I can see that I have found something dirty in here. Good. And I continue that job. Okay, and now I continue this cleaning. cleaning. I open this throttle valve and I install this my cotton cloth in the inside. Then I rotate my valve again. Okay, looks good. And then, then these central parts, there's critical part. And let's go to look that area next. And remember to also clean this area in here connection point a little bit cleaner and then cotton pad and we can take also these areas also clean good okay looks good and then, then cotton co cloth and then I continue that job okay and then important thing that remember to clean this joint array also and in that area it is important that I, I have to open this valve totally in that way and then I can clean these all areas in here because otherwise they are like hidden in that, this back area in that way good good and now this my my throttle body looks quite okay and then remember to also take these outer pipes all of these pipes very clean and we can use also in here this carburetor cleaner and when all parts are nice and clean and also this connection plate these areas is good to install this cleaner in that way good and then I check on this area there is there is dirty in that area and very carefully I have to clean all of these areas and also these sides okay and I and also this outer area all two that part and what a cleaner this part is then the better okay excellent okay and then finally when we have this throttle body when it looks like that and when we look in this inner area and there is no any dirties in that area and then when I open this valve we also check that there is no any dirties in these sides and we rotate another side also and we look that all of these areas are clean and this shiny. Okay, and in that point I can say that now this throttle body cleaning is fine and we can install this back. Good job and let's continue my friend and thanks you, thank you for watching that cleaning video.